We've become familiar with the Eye Candy Orange since its launch in 2017. We have been talking to three mums who use the orange every day in their family lifestyles and also talking to Tom from Eye Candy. I think the best feature about the Eye Candy Orange is the buggy board. So rather than the buggy board being attached to the back, it's actually integral to the chassis. So you don't have the annoying buggy board that you trip over, you can get it up and down pavements, on the bus. Um, it's brilliant. My three-year-old absolutely loves it. Because I'm a first-time mum, I actually found it really difficult to find a pushchair. I always believed that if I needed a shop assistant to show me how to do everything, I wouldn't be able to cope with that pushchair when I'm out on my own. The first thing that grabbed me was the style. Something that kind of people don't really know about Eye Candy is we're a, we're a family business. Okay. Um, and the family business was started back in 1933 as, as a fashion wow. company. So we have lots of roots in fashion. We've got a design team based here in the UK. The great thing about that is our team, they're not looking at trends within the nursery industry. Mm -hmm. They take inspiration from elsewhere, so they are, they're very lucky. They get to go to fashion shows and you know, look at the catwalks in Milan and London oh, and all these fantastic. different places. I chose the Eye Candy Orange because I was looking for a pushchair that could kind of grow with my family. I already had two children, one that needed a ride on board and one that was in a seat and I knew that we were going to have a future child so I wanted to also be able to adapt the pushchair and change it into a double. It's a brand that I knew and a brand that I trusted. There's so many configurations, uh, it's just brilliant for a baby and a toddler. I chose the Eye Candy Orange, not just for the look and the reviews, but the fact that it will be able to adapt and grow with my family if we go on to have a second baby. Um, also as well, when she gets a bit older, um, she'll be able to use the inbuilt buggy board. And just the fact that it will be able to grow and last my family is a brilliant feature. The basket underneath has, is huge. I can put absolutely everything in it. I haven't got to worry about taking any extra shopping bags or anything like that. One of the biggest baskets in its class mm -hmm. to start with. It holds 64 litres in capacity. Wow. 10 kilograms in weight, so plenty of room for, for all the shopping that you might have. Of course, yeah. Actually, the orange is no wider than our peach product, so it's, it's been designed to still fit through a single door exactly the same way that the peach does. When I'm out and about looking at people using the product, you know, I, I see a lot of people not using the elevators, and, and I, I just can't stress enough how fantastic they are and how great they are to use. So um, the elevators raise the height of the seat unit in parent-facing or in world-facing mode. So in world-facing okay. mode, it's going to give you easier access to the child. So yes. you've got yeah. less far to bend, which is better for your back. Um, and the interaction is better with the child as well. Again, we've talked about this, that the closer we can get the baby to the parent, the better the development and interaction is. And in world-facing mode and elevators, it raises the seat unit to the height of a standard table. So you can also use the push chair nice. as a high chair as well. So yeah, if when you, when you get the product, make sure you're using the elevator adapters. You know, out to dinner and they haven't got a high chair or especially with Annabelle's seven months so when she sits in a high chair often she's sort of slumped over to one side um, you don't need to worry about you haven't got a high chair and a buggy you just put the elevators on she's at table height really easy to feed her um, we actually tend to leave them on because she's just higher generally which gives you even more basket space she loves being up high you can you know talk to her and um, I think they're a, they're a great idea. We, we often forget to take, <laughs> take them off again once they're on. The push chair is great for out and about. It's great for me getting out and walking the dogs. Um, it's so easy to go across all terrains. The fold is great. You can fold it down with the seat attached, which is fantastic. I always brag to my friends about this um, as they struggle with theirs a lot. So. I just think that eye candy is brilliant for that. It also is freestanding and it's easy to store away in the house, a brilliant size that it folds down to. Aubrey, what do you like about the push chair? I like the board. You like riding on the board? Yeah. Do you like it when we go fast? No. No. <laughs> <laughs>